sweeping through a local church for a second time this week. That has officials wondering if it's the work of an arsonist. KTLA's Alina Bobian live in the Chesterfield Square neighborhood of South LA with the latest. Alina, good morning. Jess, good morning. That's right. It's still under investigation if this was arson or an accident, but two fires in 48 hours, a very alarming situation. Now, take a look behind me. This is the church. You can see firefighters still out here this morning working to put it out. The initial call came in around 3.15 this morning. This is the 2100 block of Slauson Avenue in the Chesterfield Square area. According to the fire department, the fire started at the building next door and spread to the church, a commercial building which shares a wall with the one story church and the commercial building set to be vacant for about three years now about 50 firefighters responding to this many of them still on scene at this hour thankfully they were able to keep the flames from reaching the inside of the church at some point it was a knockdown in about 30 minutes as for the cause of the fire it is still under investigation initially it was the, it was the attached office space and that's when our firefighters went interior and then uh, it, the fire quickly spread into the church. And when they went in there, there was some structure compromise in there. A good portion of the roof has came in on the church right now. Now, as we mentioned, this is the second blaze in 48 hours. So this is what you're seeing now. It is the first fire on June 11th that started on the roof of the building, causing heavy damage inside the church and the adjoining building that was full of old furniture. The cause of the fire, again, still under investigation. Unfortunately for the people in this neighborhood, they've lost their place of worship. Now, back out here live, I'd like to bring in Adam Van Gerben, PIO for LAFD. Good morning to you, sir. So do we know if the two fires, the one on the 11th and this one, are they connected? Uh, we don't know at this time if they are connected, but what we do know is that we had two of them within the 24 hours. Our firefighters arrived on scene for the second one. They did have heavy fire showing on arrival quickly spread to the adjacent uh, church and we uh, went defensive on this where we had fire showing through the roof uh, almost on arrival. When you left on the 11th, you said it was a complete knockdown, so no no sign of it being a flare-up. That's correct. We had a complete knockdown at the time and like, like I said, this is uh, with, it's about 24 hours later that this second fire started and there was heavy fire showing on arrival, but we did have a complete knockdown when we for the first fire. And is this suspected to be arson? Any suspects or person of interest? Uh, no suspects at this time, but we do have our arson investigators who are on scene, and they're going to be doing the cause and determination of this fire. All right. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. As you can see, they still have a lot of work to do out here, so no word on when Slauson will reopen. That's the very latest. I'm Lena Bourbon reporting live in South L.A., KTLA 5 News.